What's up, noobs? I just went to the New York Build Expo at the Javits Center for the first time since the pandemic hit. Actually, this was the first in-person conference of any kind that I've attended in over two years, so it was nice to network with people face-to-face, -face, even though I kind of forgot how social interaction works. Or maybe I never knew in the first place. Anyway, this is an annual expo where hundreds of vendors in design and construction show off their products, and it's a good way for me as a developer to figure out what's out there that can help me do my job better. I went around and picked out my top 10 best prop tech and sustainability booths in show, and I asked them to give me their 30 second pitches. If I had to pick a theme for the prop tech this year, it was definitely 3D mapping. There were almost a dozen different vendors using variations of this tech, and a bunch made it on my list because they serve different niches and actually don't compete with each other, so it's nice to see the space maturing. So this is Ben from Canvas, give us your 30 second pitch. Canvas is an app that helps save remodelers, interior designers, and architects hours on measuring and creating as-builds. You walk through a home with your iPad or iPhone, scanning the wall as if you were painting them basically, and within two business days, we deliver a design-ready, editable CAD model in SketchUp, Revit, Chief Architect 2020, or a 2D floor plan as a PDF or an AutoCAD file, so that you don't have to do that measuring and modeling yourself, and you can focus on what you like to do, design. Amazing, thank you, Ben. All right, this is Kevin, he's from Belter Tech. Give us your 30-second pitch. Hi, this is Belter Tech. What we do at Belter Tech is make the world's lightest concrete. We use your garbage to make it. So we take garbage out of the landfills and we make our concrete the, head, the lightest in the world, lightest and greenest. All our products have recyclable content in it and it has the highest strength, just as normal concrete. Awesome. And this thing really is incredibly seconds, light. Bro. This is Patrick with Build Dots. Give us your 30 second pitch. So what Build Dots does takes the uncertainty out of construction. What we do is we use 360 images from a GoPro uh, and then we compare that to the client's BIM model and then the client's schedule. What we're able to do with that information then is essentially track against progress and automate that progress tracking solution. So on top of that, the idea there is about this level of objective data that we have on our project. What we don't want is the he said, she said, finger pointing between GC, subs, client, developer, all that stuff. We wipe the slate clean. Objective data, single source of truth, foundational information that everybody can rely on. And that's the key of what Build Outs is trying to do. It's not about the image, it's about the story behind that image. Hi, I'm Michelle from Brooklyn Grange. Uh, we're here today to promote our landscaping department. We do all manner of greenery installations from green roofs to container gardens, terraces, uh, green walls, in ground, anything really that involves plants um, in and around New York City, we can take that on. Um, we also have a division of our company where we farm rooftops. We have three locations, uh, one, uh, one in Queens, two in Brooklyn, uh, where we are farming and growing vegetables and selling vegetables to the community. We're also at the Javits Center where we operate the Javits Farm. The produce is grown right here and uh, sent to the Javits kitchens and used in their uh, cafeterias. Hi, my name is Jonathan Ehrlich. I'm the Chief Operating Officer of T2D2. We're an artificial intelligence software company that uses AI to detect damage in facade inspections. We use all different types of technologies, including drones, to conduct facade inspections, and we process it through our proprietary algorithms in order to detect over 100 different types of damage on diff over 10 different types of uh, building materials. Hey everyone, uh, I work for Oro. Oro is the smart living system. Uh, we combine intelligent lighting, a smart home system, and communication into one simple to use system that wires in like a normal light switch and then has sensors built in that automatically adjust and adapt the lighting for you, providing your light with the right amount of light, your body with the right amount of light, and then connecting and controlling all these other smart home devices like Sonos, Ecobee, Nest, and so I'm Ryan from Pix4D. We're a photogrammetry company, so we take photos from drones, from phones, from DSLRs, point shoots, honestly, photos from anything. Uh, take them, stitch them together, and create accurate 2D ortho mosaics and 3D models. So you guys can actually get accurate volumes, accurate contours, accurate measurements of your site, of your house, of your project, of your backyard, of your landscape. So instead of uh, paying for a surveyor to come down or paying for an expensive laser scanner, you guys can fly these things cheap, walk around with your iPhone, and then stitch all these pictures together to get very accurate, very good 3D models. What is this thing there? So this is the Vidoc RTK receiver. So this is a GPS receiver where you can attach it to the back of your iPhone and get centimeter accurate positions. So 
you can actually use it as just a regular GPS receiver to take a single point measurement to get X, Y, Z, whatever of your location and your coordinate system, or when using it with our free pix 4 d Catch app that's on the iOS App Store and Google Play Store, it'll actually geotag all the images you take with centimeter accurate precision. So that way when you bring it into our software, it will automatically land and process and line up with all of your proposed, your design line work, all of that, and it's ready to go for you guys to start designing off of. Awesome, all right, thanks Ryan. Thanks Derek. Hi, um, we're here with Advanced Math Systems and this year at the New York Build Show, we're introducing the Arctic Tile line. Our company has been in the winterization market since 2009, and this is a brand new, sophisticated, plug-and-play snow melt system. It's completely structural, and it'll arrive on site looking as beautiful as this. In this example, we're showing you different resinous flooring systems from the granite to the paint chip. We've got designs, we have shapes, we also do lighting. The Arctic Tile will install quickly. Uh, it comes with a map. You simply just need to place it down and then hook it up to a power source. So it is really the evolution of roofscapes that we've created here. This is Austin from Navis, and he's going to give us a 30 second pitch, and he's going to tell me what the heck I'm wearing. So, Derek here is uh, wearing our brand new. VLX, which is a mobile mapping SLAM device, uh, standing for Simultaneous Location and Mapping. Uh, it has two Velodyne pucks, one on top, one on the front, and four 20 megapixel cameras to capture 360 imagery. As you move around the space, this heads up display here will show you exactly what you're capturing. All the data gets stored onto this SSD here. Once it's uploaded onto your computer, you can process it on the cloud. From there, the entire uh, workflow is all cloud and web-based. Um, providing you with the virtual walkthrough as well as a fast, high accurate point cloud coming in at 5mm accuracy. This one's not prop tech or sustainability, but I was pretty blown away by the look of these tiles. Our architect on the condo conversion project had recommended looking into large format porcelain tiles for our bathrooms, and I got to see it in person here. Alright, that wraps it up for this year's expo. Let me know in the comments which one you like best. Stay curious, noobs.